When you first got in the business, you started as an intern, which means you were going to do anything, right? But ultimately, you, you, your focus wind up being more on the marketing side mm -hmm. of things. Mm -hmm. You know, talk about that a little bit. Yeah, you know, I'd, I'd had the, the opportunity to do a lot of things at IRS from promote radio promotion and merchandising and uh, I did the mail room and I was the mail room and I was the, you know, merchandising boy and and so I, I had a, the nice part about working at a small label is you get a lot of different, you touch on a lot of different experiences. Mm -hmm. This is way before the internet. So. Yeah. Um, and so I, I, and I really thought that um, that marketing and putting, I like to put things together, mm -hmm. you know, and, I like, and I'm, I'm sort of a macro economist, mm -hmm. I was an mm -hmm. econ major, I was better at macro than micro, though I can do both, mm -hmm. but I, I like the idea of, of thinking big picture and long term and timeline and mm -hmm. all that, and promotion's more short term, and, and, and I did dabble in A&R for a while, but you know, the truth is, I, I don't think I was musical enough to be an A&R yeah. person, and, and so, I, and, and just marketing suited my skill set. Yeah. Interesting to say, you hear you say that about, you know, um, the A&R thing, because so many people, that was kind of the glimmer position with mm. the A and R guys, right? And yeah. back in the day, the A and R guys were really like the stars of the company. I think about John Kalodner and and um, Michael Goldstone at Epic Records, and if, you know, I'll sure. remember a few others here. But um, it does take some people that are that are seeing the thing out just slightly outside of that very personal side of making music to yeah. to. Um, to have more of an objective or less emotional opinion. Do yeah, you well, find that that's true? I agree. And I, I, but the other side of it too, though, is I think the best A and R people are really mm. great marketing people, mm. and the best marketing people have an A and R sense. Mm. You know, and so when when you can think kind of both sides of your brain, mm. that's when you when you really can can do special things. Yeah. Do you find that that your your frame of reference was more from a consumer side? I know for me, because I wasn't a musician, but I definitely have an opinion like you about music. I you know we, we couldn't have gotten this far without having some sensibility about what what right. works or not. Um, but you know th th that the being able to see it from outside that box you know allows you to to be somewhat detached whereas that music making process the creation process i don't know about you i always felt horribly uncomfortable even going to the studio i thought what am i supposed to do yeah yeah i i felt more comfortable in the studio probably than you did mm -hmm. and but i agree you, you, there's a point where you have to kind of move yourself and say okay, who's the audience for this music? Mm -hmm. What's special about this artist? How mm -hmm. do you differentiate? Mm -hmm. And you know, that's like any marketer with mm -hmm. your product, if mm -hmm. you will. And so, um, and, and that's where I felt really right in my pocket, so yeah. to speak. But you know, when you get into changing keys and, and you know, moving the fifth part over here in the B section and whatnot, you know, you can understand all that. Mm -hmm. But, and, and I have a passion for music. Mm -hmm. I, I absolutely love music, otherwise I still wouldn't be doing this stuff. But, but you know, taking, the, taking a different point of view and trying to fit that square peg in a round hole because there are a million bands out there, you mm -hmm. know. And how do you differentiate? Just because yeah. you have money mm -hmm. and expertise, but you've got to be in a little bit better. And that's when you talk about the role of a label. The role of the label is to do. That's a huge part of it. Is to differentiate and to actually add value to that process. Yeah.